Hello everyone, I am Dr. Eric Morrison. This is 7 out of 3, and I'll be covering trading education using the TC2000 and TradingView platforms. Hello, this is the Forex Week in Review with the 28 majors and minors and 6 exotics. And I'll start off with the Sunday Monday phase with the COD Indice. First one was Aussie Dallas was Frank, $30 gain. Cats was Frank with a $290 loss. Euro USD, the $268 gain. British Pound CAD, the $593 gain. British Pound Swiss Frank, the $129 gain. And British Pound US Dollar, biggest gainer of biggest gainer of them all, $676 gain. For grand total for the week of $1,406. Five wins, one loss. Now we did have a cut index C for the basket of currencies less the dollar and the foreign currencies had a cut index of 100 zero, zero, and it is crowded short as you can see here and what happened price moved up and the dollar went down it was also maxed last week significant drawdown and decline of the dollar this week so going into Next week, the cut indice has now fell out of tolerance as far as overall crowding. It is still crowded short, however, the cut indice is not in support. So our probability is a lot lower, and the dollar could rebound and continue an upward movement. I do want to cover uh, Z3 longs and shorts. With the cut indice maxed out, and we had a cut index differential, and it was also crowded short, we placed a buy stop order here on the Z3 and it did trigger. We got a nice little bounce and gain off the Z3. $412. For British Pounds with Frank we had two of them bounce. So the first bounce Z3 was here for the Z3 long. We had a cut index maxed out. Bounced up all the way up to here and closed. It was out and placed another buy stop order here. Did the same thing by and up. Nice overall gain $723. New Zealand CAD also did a nice Z3 short. We had a cut indice to the short side with the Z3 order here at the top. It went up, shot up in here, hit our overall sell stop order and closed with a nice gain of $101. We have the British pound, New Zealand dollar. We had a, a Z3 long order here with a cut indice differential. It triggered nice overall profit of $230 and overall profit for the five Z3 trades. So I wasn't even expecting any of these trades to execute. I just go ahead and follow the Z3 with the COD index differential. Overall profit of $1,467. Five Z3 trades. Nice overall gain for the week at $2,874. So looking for next week, we have Canadian dollar, Japanese yen, New Zealand CAD, New Zealand Swiss franc, US dollar CAD, US dollar Swiss franc, US dollar, Japanese yen, and South African rand, Japanese yen. Max crowded long. We have the greens, Swiss franc, South African rand, British pound, New Zealand, British pound, US, British pound, South African rand, and US dollar, Mexican peso. Max crowded short with the COD index. Some of them have COD index differentials, and some of them have COD indexes. Weak buying positioning, Aussie dollar, CAD. Aussie dollar New Zealand, Aussie dollar US, Aussie dollar New Zealand US dollar. Week sell positioning, we have Euro Aussie dollar, Euro CAD, Euro Swiss franc, Euro British pound, Euro Japanese yen, Euro New Zealand, and British pound Swiss franc. All the others are mixed, is represented in purple, with different COD indices respectively. If you're interested in these kind of strategies going forward, or programming in both PineScript or Python, yeah, or joining Crowded Market Report and Understanding the Commitment of Traders Tables. Click on the links below and remember Ruthless Risk Management. Have a great week everybody and I'll see you on Sunday. Well if you like this video hit the like rumble button below and the subscribe button and if you want more information click the course information links below. On the TradingView link and on TC2000 I have an affiliate link if you open up a TC2000 account you will receive a $25 discount using that link. Thank you for your time.